I'm Melanie Baran with JL Wyatt Properties and this is your Houston September 2021 market update. Now don't forget if you are looking to buy or sell a home in the Houston area or really anywhere else, you can go ahead and tap that subscribe button. If you're in the Houston area, I am happy to help you with that. If you're outside the Houston area, I've got a great referral network of agents all over the country that I can help you find. So either way, tap subscribe, make sure that you hit that notification bell so you get all the information that you need on your home buying journey. Now that we're past all that, we are going to talk about what is going on in the Houston area. And let me tell you, it's a great time to be in Houston. Of course, I am kind of partial. I always think it's a great time to be in Houston. Maybe it's just because it's my hometown, but let's talk about Houston. One of the big numbers that we, that has just drastically impacted the real estate market over the last year is the months of inventory. Basically, how many homes are for sale? How many months would that take for that number of homes to completely be sold out? And since the past couple of years have been, well, the past couple of years, the market has been a little crazy and it's been really tight going into the end of 2020 and into 2021 the number of homes for sale kept going down and down and down for a variety of reasons you had uh, lumber shortages due to wildfires in the pacific north northwest lumber prices increasing due to t tariffs going across the canadian border right so that made homes more expensive having having work in er, work interruptions I don't know why I can't talk today. Having work interruptions uh, may, meant that new construction homes were paused, which meant there weren't as many. And so we get into this supply and demand issue of the supply is getting more expensive due to construction costs. Demand is is rising due to low interest rates. Um, you know, there aren't as many homes for sale because people aren't moving because they're unsure of what the economy holds and all of that for the for the next you know year, year and a half, two years. So the nice thing is. A lot of those things are calming down. As a matter of fact, we are seeing the highest number of inventory we have seen all year long right now. This is September, so using August numbers that just came out, the inventory for the Houston area is 1.9 months. Now that is lower than it typically would be this time of year, but that is the highest it has been since the very beginning of the year. I told you a few months ago, June, June, we saw an uptick in inventory for the first time since April of 2020. So it had been over a year since inventory had actually gone up. And in June, it went up just a little bit that month. And I said, hey, this is exciting. It's not a trend yet. Well, let me tell you, inventory has gone up June, July, and now August. I would, I would be comfortable saying now it is a trend. In April, inventory was down to 1.4. We have trended up every single month, and inventory is now up at 1.9, and I am really optimistic that it is continuing in that way, that the new builds are being finished, those are being added to the market, people are feeling more comfortable with where they are pandemic-wise and economy-wise, so we're just gonna see, I'm, I'm really excited to see next months come out because I think we're gonna hit over two months of inventory for the first time in in almost a year. So that is your real estate update. Inventory is going up. You have home prices. I can, let me get you that median price real quick. The median sales price for the Houston area in August of 2021 is $310,000. Last year at the same time, it was $269,000. That is an increase of 15.2%. So if you're considering selling, those home prices are continuing to rise and it's a great time to get as much as you can for the home that you're in so that you can put that into your next home. If you're considering buying, you wanna make sure that while these home prices are are, are rising that you are taking advantage of the interest rates that remain low so again it's a great time to be in Houston I think it's always a great time to be in the Houston area because I'm a Houston girl I am happy to help if you are considering buying or selling in the Houston area I would love to help whether that's you or whether you're just binge watching real estate content on YouTube for funsies make sure that you leave a comment or ask me a question and I am happy to help you as much as I can I'm Melanie Baran with JL Wyatt Properties I hope something really great happens to you today.